I would like a Cuban spring in 2013 to help the people of Cuba liberate themselves. I do believe the people of Puerto Rico uh, have the right to clarify their status, uh, and it has been a very long time, and I think this is an issue which, which uh, I, uh, by the way, I had, this was my position when I was speaker. So it's not, yes? All right. States armed forces than any other state in the union. We have four million Puerto Ricans in the United States who are voters. We have 52% of our children who are in poverty. The question is very simple. You want our vote? Yes or no? Only I don't want you or any other candidate as Obama did to us to make the decision. We will be going to referendum. The question is, do you believe that Puerto Rico should be a state or not? Simple. What I believe, I just say what I believe, and if you don't like it, I'm sorry we disagree. I believe the people of Puerto Rico should make the decision. It's not my place to lecture Puerto Ricans. But what I'm telling you is, if the people of Puerto Rico make the decision they want to be a state, I will work actively to help them negotiate the process of accession to the, US, the United States. But the people of Puerto Rico have got to decide their future. And I, well, I, I'm, so I would welcome them if they make the decision, but I will not tell them what decision they should make. Period. Now. I am for English as the official language of government. And the fact is, English is the ultimate language of maximum opportunity. Every parent who comes here knows this. They all want their children to grow up and have the maximum chance to have a good job and to rise. This should not be controversial.